Successful, generous, dependable, and protective. Those are the words that describe this month's mutual energy between you and your person. Hi, this is JC with Scorpio Otero, and today I'm doing a reading for the fire sign of Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Keep in mind, this is a general reading, so not everything in this reading will pertain to your situation. So take what's yours and leave the rest for someone else. In order to save time, I've gone and shuffled the cards, so let's do it. So remember those three words that I said in the beginning. Successful, generous, dependable, and protective. That is the mutual energy you and your specific person are feeling this month, February 2024. You both are will be demonstrating love through action instead of just words. Creating a stable and loving home for the family. This energy is a very slow energy, and it's slow to make a commitment. But anything that's slow is worth waiting for. Because the both of you are approaching this relationship very seriously. And you both want to fully understand it before y'all take the next steps. This energy between the both of you is very secure and very stable. The two of you will be very comfortable, both emotionally and materially. You both have worked very hard to get this to this point in your life. So enjoy Sagittarius with your person. So what is the challenge this month? The challenge that you two face is the Ten of Swords. You and your person are coming into this relationship with past trauma, past hurt, from past people. This is where both of you will have to heal that past trauma. Let it in. Let it go. Those things are in the past. There's nothing you can do about those items. But you can learn from them and move forward. Yes, we all have feelings of anger and despair from past hurt and past relationships. But we must take the lessons that heartbreak has taught you. Because once you learn the lessons and recover from the situation, the stronger you're going to become. This is not only you, Sagittarius, but your person as well. And this could be you healing each other in order to end that past cycle. So Sagittarius, let's look at your energy coming into this month. Your energy coming into the month, Sagittarius, is that of a transformative energy. You have the death and rebirth card. Again, this is about cycles ending for you, relationships that no longer work for you, thoughts about love that no longer work for you. Just as the challenge card says, you have to end past cycles, learn the lessons, transform and get stronger. But what this card also is telling us is that you need to be able to accept change, especially if this is your second or third go around with your person. Just remember, for every door that's closed, a new one will open. Sometimes we need that ending in order to transform and grow as an individual. This also indicates allowing and accepting change in your relationship or just let it go. You have the decision to make. But as your main energy part indicated, you're accepting change. So what does the King of Swords say about your person? Your person is coming into this month as a cool, controlled, and ambitious person. Even though they're not showing any emotion because of the restraint, they're, they do have them. They're kind of looking at their intelligence and their logic right now when it comes to love and romance. They're approaching their relationships ethically and respectfully. Now, they might not come off very romantic, and they might express themselves a little blunt, but they still have a lot of love for you. They do value the relationship you have with them, and they're placing a high standard towards it because they need someone to stimulate them intellectually as well as romantically. They desire you to be at your very best. And in return, push them to be their very best. And that is all I have for you, Sagittarius. Thank you for watching this month's reading. Please let me know in the comment section if there's right thing. Also, please, if you don't mind, please like, share, subscribe, follow, save, and repost this video. I appreciate it. Thank you.